Hi everyone! I'm here with Brittany today, Hi guys. who is our master spray tan artist here at Clarity, and we are going to answer some frequently asked spray tan questions and also tell you why you need to get a spray tan to not this Tuesday, but the next yes, two weeks. weeks. Yes. Yeah. What's the date? December 3rd. De Tuesday, December 3rd. Keep that in mind. Mm -hmm. All right, so let's get started. You ready? Yeah. Okay, so here are some frequently asked questions that you guys have sent us or that we hear a lot here at Clarity, yes. and we want you to always be prepared for your spray tan. So Brittany is going to answer them all for us. All right, first of all, how long does a spray tan typically last? So typically you can get about seven to 10 days out of it, mm -hmm. but that's with taking care of it, using your lotion, not using harsh products. Yes. All that good stuff. Perfect. So if they wanted to get one for an event, how, when would you recommend they come in for their tan? So if you have an event on Saturday, I would probably come out on Thursday, mm -hmm. Thursday afternoon if you can. Um, Friday morning is fine. Yeah. But Thursday is probably the best day. Just to give you time to shower and yes. for it to develop mm -hmm. and all that. Perfect. Another question we get all the time, and this is a bad word here at Clarity, is will I look orange? It is such a bad word. We don't such say a bad word. We're no. here. Um, no. No. You will never, ever, ever look orange. Yeah. So Brittany and I both have spray tans now, and we are not, we're not orange at all. You no. can no. see. And we have different colors. We on. have different colors mm -hmm. on, which we'll talk more about that in a second so they understand yes. all the options they have. How do you prep for a spray tan? What's the best way to prep for a tan? Okay, so the three things to remember is shower. You want to be showered, no deodorant, lotion, any of that. Shave. You don't want to be hairy. Yes. And exfoliate. Um, the best time to exfoliate is actually not right before your tan. A lot of people think that. I would probably do it the night before. Okay. So, so the night before. And mm -hmm. when should they shave? The same time. The same time. Mm -hmm. So shave and exfoliate the same time yes. and then come in for your tan the next day. Yes, that's what I would preferable. do. And I've done all the ways and yeah. I find that that makes it look better. And it's because shaving cream can like leave some residual. Yes. And the strip on a razor. Oh, oh that's right. Yeah. 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 So just for your best results. And okay. So if they can't shower right before they come in, like can they come straight from work or from school? Yes. Is that an option? Yes. So we have um, towels that we can give you to take off deodorant. We also have mm -hmm. X-mitts that are good for exfoliating. So yes. if you completely forgot to exfoliate, you can have one of those. I think they're five dollars. Something like that. They're pretty yeah. cheap. And I mean, it really ensures that you have a perfect tan. So it's a no brainer. Right. I also like to use those X-mitts. Like if I've been working all day, even if I didn't put on lotion that morning after mm -hmm. showering, just like yeah. oils from your skin, right. all Sweaty. that stuff. The x have the prep solution in them yes. too, right? Yes. So it helps the spray tan go on smoother mm -hmm. and like last longer. Exactly. Awesome. Another question that we get and people get super nervous about this is what do they wear for their spray tan session? So of course we want you to feel comfortable. Um, you can wear whatever you want. If you wanted to wear a one piece, you could, or if you want to wear shorts and a tank top. I think mm -hmm. the first time I wore a spray tan, I wore like shorts and a tank top. I think I did. Like or like yeah. Yeah. Um, all the way to nothing. Like, yeah. We don't care what you wear. We just want you to feel comfortable. Um, just keep in mind, um, like lines and stuff or whatever you're going to wear. Exactly. Yeah. So anything that you leave on is going to leave a tan line. So especially we get that a lot with brides, yeah. proms, homecoming. If you're going to be on the beach in a bikini, keep that in mind. Um, mm -hmm. and a lot of women opt to just go topless. I would say that's most common. Just like we have disposable bottoms or like your own mm -hmm. underwear and then no top. Yeah. And we have disposable tops and some other things too um, that can prevent or cover you up however you feel comfortable. Right. Perfect. What should they wear immediately after their spray tan? What's best to bring the change them to? So ideally loose dark clothing. You don't want to put mm -hmm. your leggings on. No right jeans. After, no jeans. No socks. No. Yeah. Um, and we also have disposable flip-flops if you forget. We do. Just mm -hmm. like a nail salon. Yeah. <laughs> They're nail salon ones. <laughs> yes. Um, so yeah, you just don't want anything to be tight on you. You probably don't want to put your bra back on. Yeah, sports so bra. No sports bra. Please don't do that. Yeah. Um, yeah, I normally just wear like some baggy pajama pants even and a t-shirt. Yeah. Yeah. Or we a have a parking space right here outside our door. Mm -hmm. Nobody has to see you. It's right. fine. And people leave braless all the time. All the time. Mm -hmm. Perfectly normal around yeah, here. Don't even worry about it. How long do they have to wait to shower after a tan? So that depends on your the solution that you get. So 
A shower with soap is always 24 hours. Mm-hmm. Um, always, no matter yes. what solution you do. Right. No soap for 24 no hours. No soap for 24 hours. Um, and then with the rapid solution, you rinse with just warm water after three hours. One to three hours. Somewhere in that time frame. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Okay. So it's not too bad. And also I want to add to that, we have solutions that have like no smell hardly. You don't feel mm-hmm. sticky. So for no. that 24 hours, like you don't feel gross. No, You're not. Fine. I forget that I have it after. I do too. Probably about an hour. Yeah, yeah. I do too. Can you work out after a spray tan? I would not do that. Because you don't you want, want to sweat. You yeah. don't want to wear your sports bra. streaks all down mm-hmm. you. Just work out before your spray tan. Shower. Shower. And okay. then just maybe skip yeah. a day. It's fine. Yeah. That's your rest day. It's fine. Mm-hmm. Work mm-hmm. it in. Spray tan's worth it. Um, will a spray tan protect me from the sun? From UV rays? <laughs> she says no. no. It doesn't. Please yeah. use your sunscreen still. Yeah, use your Kula that yes. we sell here because it is spray tan safe. It won't break down your tan. Right. Because sun, some sunscreens will break down your tan yes, color, right? Alcohol and stuff. mineral oils, mm-hmm. things like that. Yes. So especially if you're going to the beach, if you want the color to last the whole time, the Kula SPF That's is the really way to go. Don't mm-hmm. you agree? How often can I get a spray tan? So I probably wouldn't come once a week. Yeah. Um, for example, I just got spray tans back to back, and you can ask Paige. It's it, it's impossible to exfoliate it all off. It is because it stays so well, which is it great. Does. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I would say about every ten to fourteen days, you could mm-hmm. get one. You just want to make sure that you're really exfoliating that old tan off. Yes. And we do have some clients that are super regular, that like come twice a month, mm-hmm. all year round, mm-hmm. and they constantly stay tan yep. and out of the sun, which is fantastic. How long will I feel sticky after a spray tan? I would normally say 30 minutes Mm -hmm. to an hour maybe. Yeah. Yeah. And especially, it's not. not. And especially now that we have other solutions that are more aloe based, Mm -hmm. you really don't feel sticky at all afterwards. I don't think. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Perfect. Can a pregnant woman get a spray tan? And I will add, can a nursing mom get a spray tan? (laughs) Yes. So I would definitely, as per anything. Yeah. Ask your doctor just For to sure. make sure. We've never had an issue with it. I sprayed Paige both of her pregnancies and she was fine. It's an all natural solution. Mm-hmm. Do you want to add that on? So all the ingredients are plant derived. Yes. So they're not going to harm you. As far as nursing, yes. But you just want to make sure that you cover because yeah. we don't want to transfer that color onto. No. We don't want baby. a baby's face spray tan basically no. is what we're getting at. Yeah. We also do have nose filters if you feel more comfortable wearing those during pregnancy and mm-hmm. all that stuff's no charge. It's here for you complimentary to mm-hmm. use. Um, okay. Do men get spray tans? Can I send my husband, boyfriend, brother, or dad in to get yes. a spray tan? Yes, we do yeah. have men. Mm-hmm. Um, I feel like they're always a little nervous to come in, for but sure. it's no different. Yeah. yeah. And what should a man wear to get a spray tan? Um, I would say underwear, shorts, bathing suit, anything like that, gym shorts, yeah. swimming trunks, yeah. yeah. So just not new not for the guys, please, yeah. <laughs> no. Just wear something. Um, and hair, like body hair, doesn't interfere with mm-hmm. it at all. We no. will get the skin completely, and that's good, right? Mm-hmm. Perfect. Um, do you have to spray your face? No. I never Paint spray mine. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to. I would recommend having a makeup color to match your darker spray Yeah, I wouldn't wear your normal sure. makeup because you're going to look no. totally different. But yeah. Some people don't like don't to spray to. their face just mm-hmm. like you hide your face from the sun. Yep. But then also, if you do spray your face, it feels like you have some coverage. Like you don't need any makeup a lot right. of times. Right. So that's nice as well. What kind of lotion, body wash, and SPF can I use after my spray tan? So the good news is we carry all of those here. We do. We have multiple kinds of lotions. Um, prolong lotions that'll make your color mm-hmm. extend. Regular body butters. Which have, smells amazing. Smells so good. Yeah. Um, we also have body wash. Yeah. That is Norvell as well. And then we have Kula. So. Yeah. We have you covered. We even mm-hmm. have at home tanners. Like we have the whole nine yards for you guys. So to stay out of the sun and still be tan, like we're your girls, we'll take care of you for sure. Got you. And all of our spray tan artists can help recommend products that you need, as well as our front desk front desk staff can mm-hmm. too. What can people do at home to make their tan last the longest? What do you recommend? So that's going off what we just talked about. We have lotions. Um, the Boost and the Prolong have color in them, so that does make them last longer. That's where you can get even like two weeks out of your tan as long mm-hmm. as you're consistent with it. Um, 
the body wash is really good because it's not harsh. You're yes. going to strip your tan. And then um, the sunscreen, I wouldn't say it like makes it last longer, but it's not going to protect it. it. Yeah, yeah it, it helps it, it from yeah. fading. Um, and also like no blue fuzz or yeah. washcloth. Right. You don't want to shave every single day. Yeah. Just try not to exfoliate yeah. it off if you want it to last that mm -hmm. long. Perfect. Awesome. Um, okay, let's talk about solution options. So what are their options when it comes to spray tan solutions? So we technically have two options as far as showering. So we have yeah. our rapids, which you can rinse between one and three hours. It's gonna progressively get darker over those three hours. Then you rinse, you're gonna look a little darker. I mean, lighter, you're gonna look lighter. Yeah. Um, but it's still developing over 24 hours. That's why we said not to shower mm -hmm. ever. Um, with soap, yeah. Right, with soap for 24 hours. And then our 24 hour solutions are 24 hours. You have you to You don't wait. want to sweat, you don't want to do any of that stuff right. for 24 hours. Do you want to tell them a little bit like exactly what they see as far as like the bronzer cosmetic color whenever they get spray tan versus yes. the actual DHA developer? You mean like for each solution? For all of them in general, because I do think, I know the first few times I did a rapid solution and you take a shower and all the bronzers yes. wash off and you're like, oh no, what mm -hmm. happened to it? Right. So it's basically a color guard. Yeah. And that's going to kind of show you how dark you're going to be, especially with the rapid. Um, at that three hours, that darkness is how you're going to look in 24 hours, if that makes sense. That does make sense. Yeah. And so when you see those colors going down the drain, they're just cosmetic it's Temporary. Bronzers. Basically like makeup yeah. washing mm -hmm. off you. And the DHA on your skin doesn't go anywhere. Right. Another thing, do you want to tell them how, like, you and I, we did different colors. So I did the one solution, rapid solution, and Brittany likes Venetian, which is more of a violet undertone. Mm -hmm. um, but how does it work differently with different skin tones? So we both have different skin tones. Mm -hmm. And if we have the same color, we would look completely different. Right. Um, it really just depends on how you tan naturally. Mm -hmm. And so, I mean, if you're super pale like me, I can get rapid and it's fine. You just have to just know when it fades. It's yeah. You can do the different. Scrub it off. Yeah. 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 Um, but then like if Ashley, because she's more of an olive skin mm -hmm. tone and darker than both of us, she can get the same color and she's a lot darker. She's going to look a lot darker for yeah. sure. So you can't say, oh, my friend had this and they look so dark. Like it's different for everybody. It just depends on how you naturally tan. Right, and the melanin in your skin. So it's really cool how those ingredients work mm -hmm. with our skin and look different on everyone and also look great on everyone. When should a person use self tanners? Say like our self tanning mousse versus when should they come in for a spray tan? So I would say spray tans definitely give an event, mm -hmm. um, wedding, homecoming, prom. If you're gonna wear a dress and you wanna make sure everything's even, all that good stuff. For me, self-tanner is kind of something that I do most of the time, just mm -hmm. to have a little bit of color. I'm not gonna be this dark normally with it. Right. Um, if it doesn't need to be perfect, because no one can make their self-tanner perfect. Y'all saw my <laughs> Instagram story about that. Well, because there's places that are hard to get to, like mm -hmm. your back, you can't get your right. back. So especially right. if you're gonna be on vacation, like in a bathing suit, come in for a spray, spray tan. tan for sure. Self-tanner's not the way to go. No. But like if you just want your legs to have a little color because you want to wear a dress to church on Sunday. Mm -hmm. Or, fun fact, I only tan like my arms and chest and face sometimes. There in the winter. Know, because in she's wearing pants. Yeah, yeah, yeah you can't summer. see my legs. Yeah. So, you know, if you just want a little color to feel good, self tanner. Absolutely. And again, we have this perfect self tanner for you. So come in and let us recommend one. Why would a person want to tan all year round, especially during the holidays? What do you see clients coming in for for holiday tan? So definitely parties. Yes. And pictures. A lot oh, of people get their one. family pictures mm -hmm. done, Santa pictures, if you're choosing to be in your kid's Santa picture. Um, and then, like I said, parties, New Year's Eve parties. Yes. Anything that you're going to dress up. Right. Yeah. Also, like a lot of the holiday events, people are seeing family that they only see once a year. It's so true. they want to look their best. Mm -hmm. So come in and get a spray tan because it's going to make you feel better yeah. and look better both at the same time. So we know your schedule stays very booked now with lashes and spray tans. Mm -hmm. If someone cannot get in with you for a spray tan, who else can they see here? So you can see three other girls. Yeah. So Savannah. Olivia and Erica. I've trained all three of them and they're all really good. Mm -hmm. We've had multiple trainings, so yeah, you can they can take work really with good them. care of you. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. And so they know 
pretty much all the tips and tricks that you use too. Yeah. So anyone would be safe seeing any of our yes. fantastic spray tan yes. artists. Okay, do you want to talk a little bit about our spray tan party and the special price we have? Yes. Okay. So, Tuesday, December 3rd, we're having a spray tan party. We normally don't do it this time of year, so no. it's really exciting. Yeah. We usually do it in the springtime, so this is a super special one. It's going to be $20, which is, is a huge saving. A big discount, because it's normally $45 with you. Mm -hmm. you're, so getting, is, you're getting more than 50% off. Yeah, it's amazing. Yeah. So, um, you can't go online and book. Definitely email or message us. Or call we'll, us. Yes. And we'll get you scheduled. And I would definitely take advantage of it. If you've been thinking about getting a spray tan, yeah, this is the time to try it. Even if you have no reason at all to get Just it, get it because, yeah, it's the time to try it. At $20, mm -hmm. you cannot beat that. No. And we use the same product, same everything that mm -hmm. we use for a regular appointment. Yes. It's just yeah. a great deal. It truly is. Yes. Mm -hmm. So is there anything else you want to add on? Do you feel like we covered everything? I think so. Okay, perfect. If you guys have any other questions that we've left off or that maybe you think of later, feel free to leave a comment here and let us know. Message us, call us, just reach out to us and we'll be more than happy to help you um, and book your appointments for your spray tans this December and year round. Yep. Bye guys. Bye. Thanks.